it's one of the biggest events in the history of crypto and blockchain and although there won't be any literal fireworks when the Ethereum blockchain moves from proof of work to proof of stake, true believers in ETH are still celebrating around the world. It's known as the merge and it marks the moment that Ethereum moves from a system that requires the validators that keep the blockchain running to work through a computing problem to simply staking ETH tokens as collateral for the privilege. The most significant impact of this is that the network will cut its overall energy usage by more than 99%. Bitcoin pioneered the proof-of-work model of establishing consensus across its distributed network. But it has widely been criticized for the amount of electricity nodes on the network consume while solving the arbitrary math problem required to earn crypto rewards for keeping the blockchain's lights on. Ethereum followed in Bitcoin's footsteps, but developers have always maintained they may move away from proof-of-work someday. After years of planning, delays and skepticism that the day would ever come, it appears it has arrived. There isn't a specific time set for the transition, rather it is determined by the difficulty of the original proof-of-work system reaching a certain threshold. Most predictions expect this to happen after 10 p.m. Pacific time. Now, watching transactions on a blockchain switch from one chain to another isn't exactly a highly visual experience, but that isn't stopping a number of ETH maxes from celebrating with a number of watch parties anyway. The closest thing to an official ETH fiesta is the Ethereum Foundation's mainnet merge viewing party, which you can watch below starting at 7.30 pm PT, 